Hey, mobility gurus. I hope you guys are having an amazing day. In today's video, I want to discuss a very specific topic, associating your corporate domain email with Google to allow a reseller to be able to create your Android Zero Touch portal. So let's get into it. When setting up an Android Zero Touch portal, your reseller either needs a G Suite account or needs a domain account, michael.goad at domain.com that associated with Google. That, that last part associated with Google brings a lot of confusion to a lot of customers I talk to. When you associate your domain account with Google, all it's doing is allowing you to access Google services with that domain account. So in order to do that, we go to this site right here. Uh, and I'll link this in the description. So to associate your account with Google, you go to this link, fill out all the information, put your email address, your corporate email address. So your name or at domain.com or whatever that email is and uh, set up a password, hit next, and it goes through the prompts with you. When we go through this process, what's happening is we're associating this specific email to allow us to access Google services. So it's important to note that we're not actually getting a Gmail account with it. Or I've seen a lot of organizations associate a specific email like Android management at domain.com to be able to use that in their MDM as an EMM registration. So I'm in VMware's Workspace ONE. A lot of MDMs will do something similar uh, with a few UI changes, but uh, within Workspace ONE, I go to device and settings under Android, um, there's an e Android EMM registration. So in here, you can configure that email account uh, that you just associated and uh, register it within your MDM. And what this allows you to do then is access manage Google Play. So if you go to play, google.com forward slash work, you'll be able to access the managed work side of, of Google Play. And what this allows you to do as an IT admin, go in here, search for applications, and then approve them to the MDM. And then the MDM can distribute those to those devices. On the back end, we're leveraging that corporate persona that we used, that we did when we registered it with our EMM uh, under this setting right here. So that's what a lot of other organizations will do will use when they associate a Google account with their domain account is they'll use it to leverage Google services like manage Google Play and then uh, Android Zero Touch. So I just wanted to add some some clarification around what it is to associate a, a corporate domain account with Google because there is a there's a lot of confusion on what that actually means. Uh, as a whole, the TLDR is when we associate our domain account with Google, all it's doing is giving us access to Google services, leveraging that domain account. We do not get a Gmail account with that, um, but we can log into Google services with it, uh, as well as we can use that associated account to be able to create our Android Zero touch portal as well as do things like emm registration with that account within your mdm so hope that was helpful for you guys and added some clarification around what that actually means when we associate our domain account with google if you have any questions please place them in the comments and i hope you guys have an awesome day thanks bye